David Harris here with Protection Dog Sales and today we have a unique opportunity to help people understand a little bit more about pricing. The question that we get is about pricing. Why is one dog priced like this and another dog is priced like this? Behind me I have laying two giant Schnauzer males. They're brothers from the same mom, same dad, born on the same day, raised in our system exactly the same way. They both are extremely high quality dogs as far as their genetic quality, their parents, grandparents, great grandparents. They were raised in the same type of foster home. They got the love and care and attention exactly the same. Our system is very meticulous as far as the development and training. They got early positive reinforcement training that was very effective. They got travel and all the exposure that all of our dogs get here at Protection Dog Sales, yet the results were different. And the results of the two dogs training is different because of the genetic variations in dogs. Just like people and just like brothers or sisters or siblings, there's differences in every lineage. And the difference between these two dogs, these two brothers, is mental and physical toughness. One of them is a very physically tough dog. The other is not. He is immature. He is not physically tough at this point. And you'll see the difference when you watch them work. All right, so we're looking at this guy here and you can just immediately see this posture this guy's got, this you know sort of excited nature he has. He wants that rag. He's physically and mentally tough. He's quick to engage watching you know jumping in and grabbing and tugging he's just physically a tougher specimen between the two dogs and what this correlates to is us being able to push him in the obedience training we've been able to put more pressure on this dog to perform because his drive is high now Kayla is going to demonstrate our other dog and you can see this is a lovely dog. He's got a nice heads up attitude. He moves along very nicely. He's wanting to work. He's got a little cold today so we're not going to be worried about that. You'll notice this dog's posture. His ears are down and it's not because he's upset or worried or afraid. It's just his natural demeanor. This is who he is. This is what he believes about himself. It's his character. We talk about character as soft, medium, and hard. And this guy has a medium character. He's not a soft dog, or he couldn't do any of this work. But he's not a hard dog. The other dog you saw kept his ears up almost all the time. And once again, these dogs are trained identically. They were trained with the same techniques, the same methods of training. Everything is the same. You see, this dog wants that food. But he's like, yeah, this concrete's hard. I'm not really wanting to roll over on concrete. The other dog didn't want to roll over on concrete either, but he did. They both have drive. Both of these puppies, as early uh, evaluations, had good drives. They have food drive, toy drive, social drive. They had very similar drives. One dog is physically tough. He's even wearing goggles. It doesn't phase him to have these protective eye wear on. The other dog would completely shut down if he had that. And this young dog here, once again, he's only 14 months old, physically very hard and mentally prepared to do this kind of work at this young age. This is a young age for a giant schnauzer, okay? You can see those teeth snapping. You can see him pulling and engaging. And this is a very, very hard sleeve that he's being offered to grip. You can hear that thump into that sleeve. The other dog is not physically tough. He wants to chase, he wants to grab, but because he's immature, same age as the other dog, he's mentally immature, he doesn't want to commit. So we have to bring out a little puppy type toy for him to grip and, and he's gripping it nicely. And this dog has a bright future. There's no doubt about it. This dog is going to get there. But at this day, at this time, this is what he is and this is his price today. One matured quicker mentally and the other did not mature as quick. Now, the end results at three years, four years of age, both these dogs are going to be very, very similar. 
but right now there's a big gap in their development and that is driving price. Now other things that drive price are looks, sometimes a dog's ears just don't set right, sometimes a dog has a coat that's not luxurious or beautiful, just a, a characteristic of that dog, sex, sometimes there's a demand more for one sex than the other sex, breed, uh, these giant schnauzers are non-shedding so that is a big selling point. If you have a German Shepherd and a Giant Schnauzer that are exactly the same level of training, the Giant Schnauzer might sell for more simply because there's fewer of them and demand is high because of the, the low shedding aspect of a Giant Schnauzer. So there's a lot of aspects and we'll explain all that and work with you. But once again, we had a unique opportunity to show these dogs working, healing, doing protection work. So the other big issue is this is a protection dog sales company. We sell protection dogs. And not every dog that we develop is going to be a strong protection dog. And one of the phrases that I coined years ago is demonstrable protection. We have to be able to demonstrate that this dog can do this work. We can't speculate that this dog is going to do the work. So if the dog cannot spar effectively with the helper, and show his ability to grip and to hold and to engage, then we can't sell that. Now, I can believe that this dog over a period of months, years, will become a protection dog and that when he's bonded to a family, he will develop the mindset to be more protective. I've seen it over and over in my 30-year career. I've seen dogs tighten up and mentally and physically mature very quickly once they're installed into their forever home. So I believe a lot of times that these dogs will become protective, but I can't sell that. So when you see one dog priced at X and another priced at Z, the reason is we see with our own eyes where this dog is, is in his developmental stages. One of the things you can rest assured, 30 years, we have our finger on the pulse of this market. We know exactly where the market is. We know what our dogs are worth. We've looked at every other company out there and what they're selling and how our product compares. So there's really no doubt that we have accurate pricing. Give us a call, we'll talk to you more in detail. We have a great website, we have a plethora of videos. No other company on the planet has as many videos to help the consumer learn and become educated about how to buy a personal protection dog. I hope that helps. It's not every day that we have an opportunity to see two dogs, brothers, working side by side.